A Cumberland County developer was in federal court today. David Dodd is accused of skipping out on paying contractors for work on the Capitol View project. The amounts are in the millions, and Dodd claims he just doesn't have it. CBS 21's Kirk Wilson has the story live with the Dauphin County Mobile Newsroom in Lower Swadera Township tonight. Kirk? Rob, David Dodd II began construction of his Capitol View Commerce Center at Cameron and Hearst Streets in Harrisburg in 2007. Five years later, the unfinished project is an eyesore, and the Cumberland County developer is facing up to 30 years in a federal prison. Vacant and abandoned, this structure was to be a five-story office hub that would launch the revitalization of the city neighborhood. Plans called for it to be a 215,000 square foot facility, hosting a printing operation, offices, and retail stores. Construction began in 2007. In the spring of 2008, contractors walked off the job claiming they had not been paid. A federal investigation into the use of $16.2 million of federal and state grants funneled through the city led to Dodd's arrest on felony charges, including money laundering and misuse of government funds. He pleaded guilty and is awaiting sentencing, which could include a prison term of up to 30 years. Today, contractors and other businesses appeared in federal court to plead their cases for restitution before Judge Sylvia Rambo. Among them was Robert Bailey, Jr., co-owner of H&R Mechanical in Middletown. The heating, air conditioning, and ventilation company was to be paid $1.7 million. With their work nearly completed, Bailey told the court the firm is still owed $1.2 million. Grant regulations required Dodd to be bonded. He wasn't, and the Reed administration knew it. Mayor Reed knew that Dodd wasn't bonded. He, he wouldn't, probably wouldn't have been able to get a payment performance bond because he has no history as a, as a contractor, and, and he left it go. If Dodd or whoever the general contractor was was bonded, we wouldn't be here today. Bailey says if the contractor was bonded, he would have defaulted. The bonding company would have to pay the cost to complete the project and subrogate against Dodd. Times are tough at H&R Mechanicals in Middletown these days. In addition to the $1.2 million they haven't been paid for work done, Bailey says that he and his co-owner had to borrow a half million dollars so that they could continue to get performance bonds so they could continue to do projects. They also had to lay off several employees. Meanwhile, Bailey says that as far as being reimbursed, he says he won't live long enough to see the money. Reporting live with the Dauphin County Mobile Newsroom in Lower Swatera Township, I'm Kirk Wilson, CBS 21 News.